Hey Hello. There. You might be wondering what this is. Tipu, tell yes. about it. I miss so much this fruit. I'm from Bangladesh and this is a tropical fruit. You find it in uh, India, Bangladesh and all those countries, Vietnam, China as well. I miss so much. I moved to uh, Bangladesh when I was 17 years old and I didn't saw any tree anywhere in foreign countries. Now that we are living in Florida, jackfruit is available in Florida. Wow! I love it. And the last week I found somewhere at the jackfruit and I took it myself from the tree. And by the way, we have a jackfruit tree in yes, our garden. We decided to grow a jackfruit tree, but it's not uh, tall enough yet. It doesn't give any fruits yet. But we thought before we get one of our own, let's buy one and uh, check it out. Yes, here is it. The first time I saw this, I didn't even know it was edible. I didn't even know it was a fruit. I know it looked kind of scary for me, really, I must say. What about you? What did you think? <laughs> I'm, I'm used to see a lot of jackfruit. Jackfruit, we don't, when you see it, it doesn't look so delicious. But the inside part is so delicious and so nutritious. And you like it. So how do you know actually that this is ripe? That it's edible? Well, first thing is the smell. If you feel a strong smell in the house, the jackfruit is ripe and then you can also touch the jackfruit and if you feel it soft if you feel it yes, soft yeah, it is. Yes. then jackfruit is ripe and I must say there was a strong smell in the house we were kind of wondering what is this kind of smell very strong so where do they actually go? Uh, well you can find this uh, jackfruit in Southeast Asia like Bangladesh, India, Vietnam, Thailand and China but you can also get these in tropical countries, like Florida. That sounds great. Jackfruit is very nutritious. In some countries where there is a food shortage, scientists find out that one jackfruit tree can feed 10 families, even more. That's amazing. So they plant those in specifically in countries where there's no food. Yes, uh, uh, it could be in Africa, there is a, a huge drought and those countries, jackfruit uh, is one of the nutrient, nutritious food that they are trying to grow. So you can make all kinds of meals with it then? Yes, you can eat it ripe or uh, when it's not ripe. When it's not ripe, you cook it. And when it's ripe, you eat it just like this. You know? Most of the time people eat ripe. So what are the exact benefits of this actually? Well, first of all, this is uh, very nutritious. And if you eat it, it gives you a lot of energy. And you can preserve it long time. And it can even make it also pulp. And uh, if you take a little bit of it, you can go all day long. So, so with other words, it's good for your autoimmune then? Yes, it could prevent from cancer and a lot of other diseases. Now the trees in our garden are actually too small for this one. So where did you get this? Well, I know this is the season because the summer is the jackfruit season. And I was craving to have jackfruit. <laughs> and I was looking in the internet, where can, get, where can I get a fresh from the tree, a jackfruit? And uh, after searching, I saw Facebook has a shop there and a lot of people put it there fruits, vegetables and so on that you can buy and I saw somebody is selling jackfruit from their tree and you can go there and pick it up from the tree Great idea So how do you open this one actually? Well before you open it you have to take some oil like this in your hand because jackfruit is very sticky and there, there is a kind of glue kind of uh, things inside so if you put oil and in your knife also, oil, then it will not stick in your hand or in your knife. Does it matter which kind of oil you put? You can use any kind of oil, uh, vegetable oil or whatever oil is uh, available at your home. You can use it. So 
you put it like this and then first you have to take the bottom part and then you cut it like this to separate from the top part so this is it okay and then you are it's open so you cut it here but don't go so deep otherwise you will cut the flashes and then you cut here and then you turn it you cut it here and then you turn it you cut it here So now you will take it out softly, gently. This. Wow, look at this. Wow. That's look so at nice. this. Look at this. You see? And then you'll, you can take it out this part as well. This part as well. You see? Here is it. This is a fruit. So is there a pit inside? Yes, there is a pit uh, inside as well. Here you go. Here you go. Here you go. So what are you doing exactly now? I am taking out the uh, upper part and yeah. take out the fruits inside. Okay. Here it is. Yes. You see? So this, you can clean it up. And here so is it. you can eat all of it. You can eat, except but except the, except the seed. Yes. But the seed, uh, in our country, they cooked it with the vegetables. Oh, wow. So it's all so you nutritious. Eat, you can eat the seed as well. You can eat as well the uh, uh, seed. So I will show you the seed, how it is inside. So you open it. Here is it. Here is the seed. And this one is so nutritious. And it's eaten like a dessert? You can eat a dessert or you can eat it with the pup fries. You know that uh, moody pup oh, fries? Moody. So it's like a... And mori is actually the, the puffed rice. Yeah, right? but you can eat with anything, you know, it could be dessert or if you eat it, it stays longer uh, in your uh, stomach. Okay. So here is the seed. So that would be really good for digestion. Uh, yes, it is, but uh, you should not eat also too much. Okay. Because it's so nutritious and so... Um, uh, delicious. People uh, used to eat too much, but then they feel uh, not hungry anymore. <laughs> I suppose you want to take it out, you have to take out everything? Uh, you can keep it uh, in the freeze uh, if you want. But of course, if you put it in the freeze, it will be really smelly, everything. Okay. So where do you store it then? So if you store it in the freeze, you have to close it very well with a zip, zip lockers or something or in a Tupperware that is closed, and then you can uh, deep freeze it as well. Okay. Yeah, but if you put it in regular freeze, you can probably two three weeks. It doesn't become bad. Okay. That's good. So guys, we are in the table now, and we are going to eat the jackfruit, and uh, we are going to eat with the puff rice. You see here, puff rice, and the jackfruit. So let's try. Okay. So, Pop, can you show us how we do it? Because I have never eaten the puff rice with jackfruit. Okay. So you take that in your plate. Okay. Uh, and then puff rice. So you just eat it together like that? Yeah, together. Then you go and cut it or what? Yeah, you, you don't need the seed, but uh, you know. <laughs> yes. And now what? So. Now you just eat it, enjoy it, enjoy jackfruit. Just the fork. You can eat with the fork, but I will eat with the hand. Oh, okay. <laughs> just easier. Yeah. So you can do like this, like this. 
you see? Oh, yeah. that's yeah. good idea. To do? That's so funny. Wow. <laughs> Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> it was too slippery. Looks delicious! Mmm. 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 Really delicious. Yeah, it's good with the puff rice. The puff rice is crispy and the jackfruit is very sweet, very juicy. What do you guys think? What, how does it taste, jackfruit? I like it a lot with the puff rice. Mm. That definitely makes a difference. Mm. What do you think? Yeah. How does it taste like? Um. How does it taste like? Um. Of rice and jackfruit. I have no idea what this tastes like. So it's dirty. Describe Sweet, sugary, very sweet and very. Um, also, it's very nice to have this in your mouth. It's very flesh, a lot of flesh, right? So this one is the one that's not juicy. This one is the one that is more flesh, right? Yeah. I'm gonna put a bunch of it inside. You <laughs> make a sandwich. Mmm, delicious. It's really good. Thank you, Florida, <laughs> <laughs> to giving me the jackfruit. Eh? Fresh jackfruit. Mm. Definitely, I can recommend everybody to try it. Love it. Delicious. delicious. What do you guys think? You want to eat it again? Want to eat it again? It's I'm definitely so, a nice snack. Yeah, mm -hmm. I'm so blessed that uh, we live in Florida, and uh, I can get a lot of tropical fruit, and I love it. I hope you guys enjoy, and uh, do subscribe to our channel, like the video and uh, click the notification bell so that you will not miss any of our videos yes and watch all those other videos we have we have videos on food on travel in florida outside of florida even in china right yes uh, we have uh, also nice uh, videos around our love story that you don't want to miss out so make sure you check out the channel like and subscribe and see you in the next bye bye bye, -bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye. take care everybody